Hey guys, welcome back. I want to do a kind of an updated version. I haven't had, you know, I don't have some of these sections in my books. I don't have a whole lot in. But I want to do an update, kind of updated version of what I did with the rest of my notebook. I mean, my binders, um, I still have stuff coming in to put in these. But I wound up right for right now three. I think I'm going to have to make a fourth one. Um, but this is what I have right now, and I have three right now, and I really am liking these because, um, I, you can just flip through and find out what you have, um, so that's really cool, and, but anyway, it's just more convenient, but in this one, this book, we have alloys, mylar, tens mylar and tinsel, uh, loose rhinestones, stencils and stickers, and stamping plates. Okay. I also put just these little plastic bows. I should probably go back on like bows too, but I know what they're there. But um, these are just the alloys that um, and bows that I have in here that I have like more of two of. So... There's that. And then, um, we ju I just have this one page full for right now. I am starting to collect more alloys. So, you know, there'll be more to come. Um, and I just wanted to say something else about that. Uh, this is kind of be going to be kind of be two videos in one. Um, the ones that I just have like a couple of, I... Uh, I ain't even gonna do that, but the ones that I just have a couple of, I store a different way, and I will, if y'all are interested in see how I store, like, the ones that I get that I just have, like, two of, like, from Wishes Granted, or, um, you know, like, gift mail, or swaps, or, you know, whatever, let me know, and I will show you that, too. Um, but I don't, this video is going to probably already be extremely long, so I don't want to do that. Um, but anyway, yeah, this is just what I have right now. I'm trying to grow my collection and I will have more, um, coming in in the following days or weeks. So then the next one is my Lord and Tinsel and... Let's see if I can get you a better view. That don't help either, does it? Um, so, this is my lord. And then I did... Um, was able to get front and back with pretty chunky bags. So, that's a plus. And then we have all these Mylar. I, I ain't, she's Mylar. Uh, I've seen that over there, but all these stencils. And um, then we have Mylar. I'm also growing my Mylar collection because I don't really have a whole lot right now. Um, but I've noticed they don't make as much Mylar as they do everything else. And as you can see, my child's head's right there. Because she's got to be nosy at everything. But um, here's some of the rhinestones that I have. And this page is coming out. Um, these are just rhinestones that I was like... I got with purchases or wish granted or something like that. And then we have stencils and stickers, which these are all those sticky nail stencils. And then the all these. And then the stickers. All the like small sheets of stickers I put in here. And then my what stamping plates I have now. Again, I'm trying to get this is something else that I'm trying to get more of. Um, I don't do a whole lot of stamping, but I would like to 
start doing more stamping. So we have that because, you know, stamping is like for the drawing, the artistically challenged. And I can't draw with the crap. So, you know, there, there you go. But, and then this is the second one. And this one we have glitter mixes, pigments, special pigments. Glitter, uh, regular glitters, and um, these are just, I don't keep all of my glitters in here, all of my glitter mixes. Okay, if I've got one from a swap or um, like a wish granted, or I get, you know, something, the a small amount then I put it in here um, if I made the mix I will try to put a small amount baggie in here so that I remember that it's here and then I will you know label the rest put it away no no sit down and that way I can see it but I have more um, So, yeah. Anyway, and I do the same Mom. thing with the glitter. Mom. Yeah, I do the same thing with, like, the glitter and the pigments um, if I have bulk of those. That way I can just see it so I know that it's there. But, anyway, here is the first page of the glitter mixes. And then this, then these. I've gotten quite a few glitter mixes here in the last little bit from Wishes Granted. And I'm really happy about that. Because I am really like seeing other people's artistic ability. Um, people don't always think like you do. They would put different things in there than you would do. So, sometimes that's a good, most of the time that is a good thing. Sometimes it may be a bad thing. Um, but, yeah, I love seeing, shh, no, no. I'm sorry, y'all. I've tried to do these when she's not, she's asleep or something. But she never sleeps, and she is never occupied for that long. So, I, I apologize. Um. But she's two, and she wants to be, you know, nosy about everything. But, yeah, I love to see how people come up with their own stuff. Um, they give you different ideas for what they put in their mixes and everything like that. And it's super neat to see everybody else and how creative they can be. And then... We have the, then we have the pig, special pigments. These are like, I mean, these are, excuse me, these are just regular pigments. Get down. Get down. You can't. Okay, so these are just regular pigments. Um, nothing real special, just color pigments. And then, I'm trying to get more of those to stop. And then, these are my glow-in-the-dark pigments. I still have to put these in there. Um, from my haul. Um, so, yeah, I, I'm really enjoying doing, um, collecting these. Collecting these, uh, glow pigments. They're really cool. And then... And then we have all my glitters. Stop. On the, this these pages. And these... Guys, these baseball cards are pretty forgiving. Like... You can put a pretty chunky bag of glitter in these and then still have room to put them on the back. So that's pretty cool. That way you don't waste space. You don't waste money. 
My Mommy, kids are coming in for school yeah. and being nosy, as you Mommy, can see in the background. Yeah. No, come on. And uh, so there's a bunch of different kinds. Um, I have been out of collecting Mama. stuff. I have been out of collecting stuff for quite a while, so you know, now I have to uh, restart. And so. And then that's the last page for this book. And then I had my spangles in this book. Don't you love nosy children? Do y'all have nosy children? I have four nosy children. And they have to be seen all the time. But anyway, um, I did have my spangles in this book. I could throw that in trash. I did have did have my spangles in this book that this binder but i had too many did y'all do y'all like that did y'all just see how i told her to throw that in the trash and she just threw it on the floor that was slick um i did have my spangles in this book but i had way too many so i ended up having to make a whole notebook for just spangles um so this one is just Get down. Get down. Okay, so I had to stop, but this is nothing but spangles. I'm not really going to go through all these spangles because they have been in all my haul videos previously to this. So if you want to know what all is in here, go look at my haul videos because that would make this video really, really long. But anyway, um, here are all the spangles that I have so far. And, yeah. So, we can see your head, too. Much. So, I have quite a few spangles right now. And so, yeah, that's my book for Slangles, and those are my notebooks and my binders so far. Um, like I said, I'm probably going to end up with a, probably with another one for glitter because it, these are only one inch, one and a half inch binders, and it doesn't make for what you put in them to be very chunky. Um, it just starts, these start to bend over time. So that's no fun. Um, I need to, I could have just got, if you want to put more chunkier stuff in yours, like glitter, and I have to make a whole bond, another binder for glitter, then just get you a bit bigger you know, a bigger binder. Um, this is, I had these on hand already. So that's what I used. Um, I didn't want to go out and buy uh, like a three inch one or whatever. So, and I had several of these from where we were school shopping. So we had those left over. So I just used those. Y'all hear, hear her in the background. <laughs> but anyway, there they are. And um, like I said, if y'all want to see how I store my other bows and other things, I can do a storage video as far as that stuff's concerned. Um, just let me know if you would uh, like to see that. And I will surely do it. I have a... A bunch of nail videos coming up as far as testing out the products that like the acrylics and stuff that I bought um, and showing you what they look like um, so yeah stay tuned for that and um, as always comment like and subscribe don't forget to hit the bell and we'll see you in the next one bye